We're here at AQS Quilt Week at the Fall Paducah Show, and I'm here with Sue Dario from Crystal Lake, Illinois, and you won third place in the Large Quilts first entry in a Paducah contest sponsored by Brother. I did. And was that a surprise? I did. Um, an incredible surprise, definitely. Well, so now you know that your quilts are good enough to be able to enter them in the contest and win. Yes. So let's talk about your quilt now. First of all, uh, where did the design come from? So the design is a block of the month from, um, I believe it's the Stitching Post. They had a block of the month for this and it was a 10 month, uh, 10 month program. Okay. All right, and you used lots of solid colors, so did you just have a good stash? I do, I love, <laughs> I love solids, and I had at least 100 different fat quarters sitting there just waiting to be used somehow. So the block of the month was, was this? Yes, it, it, it was the square here, and each star with a sampler inside, so you can see that each one has a different center. And then they had one month where it was a nine patches, but. This mm. is, so this was a nine month and then the 10th month was here. But you've really changed the focus of that block clear out to here with your quilting, haven't you? Yes. Your yeah. quilting is beautiful. I love the secondary designs. Thank you. Thank you. And that's what I was trying to do. Rather than having a quilt on the di diagonal with a block here, a block here, I tried to make the focus so that this was the block here and pulling the designs out into the corners to where this, for the most part, became more of a sashing instead of a, a block. Right, well, it certainly worked. And, and then, of course, the beautiful feathers at the top are, uh, are outstanding. And, well, I guess you do it all the way around the border, don't all, you? All the way around, and that was, that's how I started. So when I put it on the frame, I had no idea what I was going to do except feathers. I love feathers, <laughs> love feathers. So I started on the border, and that's how that all started. Just wanted to get the focus. I like the feathers where they pop out and the background is pushed push back a bit so that you can see them a little bit better. And so what did you use for batting? Uh, this has a layer of uh, cotton on the back and wool on top. So that's why you get all that definition yes. from your quilting. Yes. Because you can see on these lines, it looks like you stuffed it. You get you get the puff <laughs> yes. from it. And the cotton on the back yes. helps the puff come up to the front instead of on both sides. The other thing that wool does is that when you fold your quilt up, it springs back so you don't get such hard wrinkles. Yes, and the creases from when it was folded, when it came here, you can hardly see it. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. Well, it's a beautiful quilt and congratulations. I hope we'll see more quilts from you now. Thank you. Now Thank that you, you know, much. Now that you know you can win. Now that I know. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and we hope we'll see quilts from you too. The rules for 2019 are currently on our website, quiltweek.com. Just click on the contest button and scroll down to the 2019 rules. And so we'd like to see your quilts at our shows, but we'd also like to see you at the upcoming AQS Quilt Week events.